Another thing that we just cannot stand is when a guy is on the internet flashing his money. Like, oh my gosh, like your total come up to a dollar and fifty cents. You passing mad twenties, twenty, 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 just to give her a twenty. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today. Today, I am not bringing you guys a beauty video. I am gonna be bringing you guys just a little sit down talk video. And we're just gonna talk about the things that we just cannot stand that guys do. And we just, just don't like it. It's just not attractive, like at all. If you guys are new, then like, comment, and subscribe. If you are returning, then hey, what's poppin'? So, we're just gonna jump right into it. If you're a guy, then definitely stick around because you're gonna get some tips on what we just do not like. So number one, what we do not like is a guy that just does not know how to approach a woman like at all. Like don't come to us like, yo, what up? Like, don't do that. Don't be like, yo, what's popping my? Like, I'm not your mother. You're probably around the same age as me. So it's definitely not physically possible. Um, so no, don't, don't do that. Approach us, you know, with good manners, you know, just approach us the right way. You would know how to approach, mm, I'm not going to say that because all guys do not know how to approach a woman. Just approach her, you know, be real calm and collective. Don't come off too hard. Don't come off creepy either. Like we cannot stand a creepy dude. Guys that are creepy is just like, stay away from me for real. <laughs> Just come to her, be completely honest with her. Like, hey, I just want to know your name. You know, maybe if I grab your number, we can get some lunch or whatever. If not, then that's fine. Like, give her an option, you know? Don't be like, yeah, take my number down or I'm having my sister beat you up. Like, no. <laughs> like, if she don't want to take your number, don't get mad either. Like, if she de declines you or anything like that, don't get mad. Like, there's so many other women out here. Guys be getting so mad when a girl just turn her down. Like, once we turn her down, now we ugly. Like, <laughs> you was just trying to talk to me. Like, so approach somebody with class another thing that we just cannot stand somebody that's just mean all the time like oh my gosh if you know what i mean like boy if you don't like somebody that's just mean and just not respectful like you don't gotta be mean all the time somebody that's always trying to downplay somebody and try to be all tough and we do not like that. Like, that is not attractive. So don't have any manners, no nothing. Like, just so disrespectful. Like, cannot stand somebody that should just be on disrespectful, for real. Another thing that we just cannot stand, you know, if we scrolling or whatever, you hit our inbox, oh, what up, beautiful, da da da. We go to your page. You either married or in a relationship. Like, oh, God, please, no, no, no. We cannot stand a dude that's just in a whole full blown out commitment or just like, you know, with somebody and just entertaining. Like, cause like you doing that to me, like you trying to hit me up now when I'm with you, you gonna do the same exact thing. Like you gonna be out here being real friendly. Like we cannot stand a friendly dude. Don't entertain nobody if you're in a relationship. Like that's the one thing that is just a pet peeve. Like for real like that is the number one rule do not do that be single if you want to be single like nobody has to tie you into no type of relationship at all like we cannot stand a guy that's just consistently in somebody dms like you are too friendly like come on now i'm probably like the 10th girl that you done hit up like and you in a relationship come on i don't want them problems you got a whole girl like go ahead move along because your girl gonna think i want you when i don't like <laughs> at all you came to me honey we just cannot stand that like at all like do not do not do not be in no relationship trying to entertain me or somebody else no don't do it like no because it's, it's just gonna be a number one no like mm -mm. I, don't, I don't want you like because you want a whole full-blown relationship like you gonna do that to me like don't do it Another thing that we just cannot stand 
is when a guy is on the internet flashing his money like oh my gosh like keep that in your pocket one you're making yourself a target so i do not feel safe around you at all two it's just not attractive like you always pulling out your money your total come up to a dollar and 50 cents there's no reason for you to pull out a whole stack of money i got 20s right here too but you passing mad 20s 20 20 20 20 just to give her a 20. come on now like that is just not attractive like one, don't want to know how much money you have in your pocket. If you got it, you got it. That's cool. I can see that you'll be able to have it by the stuff that you get, you know, maybe the food that you like or whatever. You probably like to take trips or whatever. You can show your money that way. Like, don't just sit there and flash your money. Like, if we going on social media and we see mad pictures of just money, 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 money. Okay, bye. I'm out. Some females do like that, to be completely honest. And that's another way for you to be another target is for you to attract the wrong woman. Like, if you feel like you just keep getting the wrong type of woman, then that's your fault because you want to know why? Because you have money on your page. That's what they want, honey. That's what you're attracting. So stop doing that. Like, delete those pictures and, you know, you'll be fine if you have money congratulations like that mean that you're doing good nobody hating on you you just too flashy like no cannot stand somebody that's just also oh flashy another thing that we just cannot stand is a liar like oh my god like why am i asking you what color shirt you got on and, it, and you say red and it's really blue why the you lying why you always lying I cannot stand a liar like well we cannot stand a liar like at all do not lie like just keep it a buck like we will respect you more if you keep it 100 like that's all you got to do is keep it 100 don't lie in my face like just don't do that just don't be a liar that is not something good if a female is asking you something definitely just decide to tell her the truth because either she already know it or she just she just already know it it ain't no other option she just already know so just don't be a liar like just don't liars gotta go out the door on the gloss, but no. don't mind this because <laughs> i did a video on this wig and i took this wig off and i'm like i'm not about to put this back down i don't have my clips on either if you guys do like this hair though definitely check out my video this a blonde. This a look. Let me stop doing this right here because it's giving away. So I'ma just. Oh my god, this side too. Okay. Anyway, last thing. We cannot stand a guy that just does not know how to communicate. Like, oh my God, we not asking for you to be, I'm not, I'm not trying to be your mom. Like, no, I'm not your mom, like at all, but at least communicate. Like, you feel me? If you're going to be gone all day or if you're going to be, you know, doing something all day, hey, what's up? I'm probably not going to be able to talk to you all day or whatever, but I'll get to you when I can. Like, it's just real simple. All you got to do is send that simple text message. And that's fine, like that that will be fine, that's cool. Another thing with communication, every time something is brought up to you, it does not mean that it's an argument. That means I feel comfortable enough to come to you, let you know how I feel, and I would expect you to respect how I feel and not take it as an argument. Like, man, go ahead, go somewhere with, like, no, don't, don't do all of that. Like, that is not necessary. Just learn how to communicate, like, for real, like, and then it'd be the worst with the people that's just oh so nonchalant, like, people be so nonchalant and just be saying, oh, they don't care about everything, knowing deep down inside that they be caring, but just don't know how to communicate, and it just be their pride, like, don't let your pride get in the way, and just know how to communicate, don't always expect that everything that comes up to you is an argument, because it's not, it's called communication, you know? called conversing not conversating but conversing if you didn't know as well well that was actually six things i think i said i was gonna do like five but girl dang
keep doing that exposing your lace just take that advice for real i hope that helps some of y'all out for real because how 2021 is set up just not even 2021 this generation in general is just like oh my gosh y'all don't know nothing like dang but is y'all really nerdies babies because like we was growing up things was completely different i think that you know i don't know i ain't a part of this generation like it's mm, i disown y'all <laughs> for real i'm not a part of this generation it's quiet no more mm -mm. Taking back to the 70s or something. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys do want more videos of, you know, sitting down, chilling, talking, talking with me, you know, talk to your computer, talk to your phone, talk to whatever I'm on, you know, I'm playing. But, you know, if you guys want more videos like this, comment down below. If you are new, like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you again for coming back to my channel and staying tuned with me. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.